Good morning, King's Kids! Good morning, Teacher Tom. Let us greet our pastor. Good morning, Pastor. Hi, good morning, King's Kids. Our HR manager. Good morning, sir. Good morning, Your advisor. Your advisor. Good morning, sir. Good morning, Your classmates. Good morning, And let us give our loudest greetings to our Lord Jesus Christ. God is good. All the time. Knowing the truth. Making the Arise and shine. Delight yourself in the Lord. In the Lord. New wine. Yes, a new bottle. Into new bottle. New wine. Each one. Bring one. Bring one. It's one. We trust in the living God. Standing firm. Unmovable. Standing firm. Rejoice in the Lord always. In the Lord always. Rejoice. Now let us have our roll call, but before that. Okay, let us start with your artists and kuyas in high school department. Grade 10, Diamond. One, two, three, go. Amen. Amen. Diamond. Amen. Teacher begins here. Grade 9, Gold. One, two, three, go. Amen. Amen. Gold. Work hard and be a leader. Grade 8, Emerald. 1, 2, 3, go. Amen, Emerald. How about Grade 7, Sapphire? 1, 2, 3, go. Amen, Sapphire. Now let us hear from the elementary department, starting with the Grade 6, Self-Control. One, two, three, go. Amen. 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 Am
Don. The pledge to the Bible. Pledge to the Bible. I pledge allegiance to the Bible. That's holy word. I will make a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. I will hide its words in my heart that I may not sin against God. Pledge to the Christian flag. I pledge allegiance to the Christian flag and to the Savior for whose kingdom stands one Savior crucified risk and then coming again with life and liberty to all. Panatang makabayan, iniibig ko ang Pilipinas, aking lupang sinilangan, tahanan ng aking lahat. Kinukop ko pa ko at tinutulungan maging malakas, masipag at marangal. Dahil mahal ko ang Pilipinas, diringkin ko ang payo ng aking mga magulang. Susundin ko ang tuntunin ng paaralan, tutuparin ko ang tungkulin ng mamamayang makabayan, naglilingkod, nag-aaral at nagdarasal ng buong katapatan. Iaalay ko ang aking buhay, pangarap, pagsisikap sa bansang Pilipinas. We believe that this education and creation of God has a special gift and learning needs. KKCA curriculum must assign to integrate faith and learning to meet those needs and to develop a child as a whole person centered in to the head of self-image, genuine love, responsibility for others, and a knowledge that God has a special plan for his or her life. Mission. Kings Kids Christian Academy was established to provide an educational experience for preschoolers, elementary pupils, and secondary students, academically and spiritually. Each program founded on biblical preserves, designed to impart knowledge, define character, and build skills which will benefit the child to a proper development and adjustment in our modern world, which will be used in serving God in His countrymen now and in the future. King's Kids Christian Academy also aims to serve families within the community. Proverbs 1 7. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge. Now, King's Kids! Are you ready to praise the Lord? Yeah. Yes. Okay, now let us call on yes. Teacher Al and Teacher Lauren to lead our praise and worship. Ding, ding, ding.
Kings, kings, are you ready to praise the Lord? Yes. 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 We want to see Jesus lifted high, a banner that flies across his land. That all is my see the truth and know, he is the way to heaven. We want to see Jesus lifted high, a banner that flies across his land. That all men might see the truth and know, he is the way to heaven. We want to see. We want to see, we want to see Jesus lifted high. We want to see, we want to see, we want to see Jesus lifted high. Step by step, moving forward, little by little, we're taking ground. Every prayer, a powerful weapon, strongholds come, tumbling down and down and down and down and down. Lord! Do you want to see? We want to see Jesus lifted high, a banner that flies across his land. And I'll see the truth and know he is the way to heaven. We want to see Jesus lifted high. A banner that flies across this land Now we might see the truth and hope It is the way to We want to see We want to see We want to see We want to see Jesus We want to see We want to see We want to see Jesus lifted high We want to see We want to see we wanna see Jesus lifted high. We wanna see, we wanna see, we wanna see Jesus lifted step by step. Step by step, we're moving forward. Little by little, we're taking down. Every prayer, a powerful weapon. Come on, 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 come Tapakan pa natin ang Panginoon. Amen! Lahat po tayo maaaring sumabay sa sayaw, mga bata.
worship our Lord and let's sing a pure heart. Be the glory. Thank you, Teacher Anne, and praise and worship team. Now, let us remain in the presence of our God for the opening prayer. Let us bow down our head again and let us pray. We ask for your guidance so we might walk fully with your blessings and goodness today. Lord, we ask that your face would, uh, would shine on us that you would open our doors for the, the right doors for our lives and that you would close the wrong doors and protect us, Lord. Lord, today, please open our eyes and our minds to accept fully your words. Bless our pastor as he delivers your words. This is all our prayer in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen. Okay, so King's Kids, do you want to see a special number? Yes. Okay, now yes. let Yes. Let us welcome our yes. symphony of kindergarten with a round of applause. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, thank you again, Abira Symphony, for a very good special number. Okay, so now for the scripture reading, let us welcome Natasha, Natasha J Jana R. Arika. If you have a Bible with you, please open it in the book of Galatians, chapter 6, verse 9. Let us not be weary in doing good, for we will reap in due season if we don't give up. Praise be to God upon reading His words. And to give us the message for this morning, let us all welcome our pastor, Pastor Lee. 
Morning po, mga King's Kids. Morning po, Pastor. Morning po, Pastor. Morning po, Pastor Lee. Thank you, Abby. Abby ay kinder 2 lang. Di ba? Isa pa tayo. Malakas pa lang pa ka natin po. Okay. Thank you. Okay. How come grade, uh, grade student, even high school student, kaya kayo ay may pag-asa pa. Kinder 2 pa, ganun magaling kayo naman. Mas magaling yan. Okay? Kaya nga, mula sa kinder patuloy training na ating Panginoon din sa patuloy palayan sa inyo. Buhay at saka sa oras na ito. Ngayon, uh, ako lang magsabi, tingnan po natin. Ngayong panahon ito, pandemic. I will talking about during pandemic. Bilang King's Key student, anong dapat gagawin natin? What are we going to do in the midst of a pandemic? Yon ang sasabing ko sa inyo. Dahil kanina pinasa natin, Bible, let us not be worried in doing good, for we will live in the due season if we don't keep up. This is in Galatians chapter 6, verse 9. Okay. What is a good doing? Doing good, I We continue worship to God. We praising God. We continue. Ay, kalugulugo sa atin Panginoon Diyos. Ay, this is doing good. Isang araw mamumungan kung tayo hindi na hindi na kiba. Kaya sa oras na ito, tingnan po natin. Ilang bagay lang. Alam nyo, na yung panahon nito, buong salibutan may sakit niya dahil coronavirus. Coronavirus ito, tawag natin, okay, buong salibutan. Yon ay tawag na pandemic. Ito po kaninang umaga, uh, every day, uh, 10 p.m. I report. This is the last night, I world, world pandemic coronavirus report. Dito sa buong mundong ito, 109 million people's now cases. Namatay na 2,427,000 2, 84 person ay namatay dahil coronavirus. Kaya we call that this a pandemic. Tingnan po natin po sa liputan dito, pinakamarami ay USA. Ay positive cases sa 28 million. Isang araw ay 49,000 people. At saka ang namatay naman, naku, po din 500,000 people sa namatay pala. Isang araw mo, 1,300 na matay. Sa Amerika na, pinakauna, pangalawa, India, Brazil, Russia, UK, France, Spain, Italy, and then Turkey, Germany. Tinala kong sampung country. Marami tao ay may positive. Marami tao ay may sakit. Marami tao na matay. Pilipin kaya. Tingnan po natin, Pilipin. Pilipin ay pang 31 pala. Nung dati, pang 20 pa rin. Pero na yun, pang 31. Tingnan po natin yan. Pilipinas, okay, dito. Sweden, Pakistan, susunod, Pilipinas. Susunod ay Switzerland and then Bangladesh. Pang 31 Pilipinas ito, 552,000 people. Na yun, araw-araw ay 1,000 plus ay Pastiba pa rin. Tingnan po natin. Ngayon namatay ay 11,000 people namatay sa Pilipinas. Tingnan po natin. Araw-araw meron pa rin namatay. Tingnan po natin sa buong salibutan ito. Ngayon kanina sinabi ko 100 ay okay, million people suffering. Ito po, last, last night ito, Corona-19 ay hindi Pilipinas lang, hindi buong salibutan. Kaya nga tayo'y nasa pahay na. Tayo ang ganong virtual worship tayo. We call that pandemic. Ano ibig sabihin pandemic? Pandemic ay talang word ay Greek word. Pan. Ibig sabihin, all yan, lahat ito. Greek word, pan means all. 
demos, ang Greek word ay people. Ibig sabihin, lahat ng mga tao, hindi isang lugar lang, kundi large religion, spread ang sakin na ito ay epidemic ay lahat ng disease ito sa buong salibita. Worldwide. Yung tawa na yung pandemic. Hindi isang lugar lang, kundi marami tao ay suffering. May sakit dito. Kaya na yun, handa na handa na bakuna yung vaccine sa ikaling sa ibang-ibang bansa. Tingnan po natin historically. Ang pandemic ito, pandemic ay hindi na yun lang. Kundi noong dati 1918, Spanish flu. Ito po isang influensya sa kinya ito. Ito po, sa pamakitang ito, tingnan po natin sa United States na America, 6 million people na mati. Six, sorry po ito, 650,000 people na mati. Ngunit, doon sa India na 13 million people na mati. Sa Australia ay 12,000 na mati. Sa pamakitang ito, influensya ito, Spanish player. Ito po, noong pa, 1918 pa, marami namatay. Naroon pa rin may pandemic. Tingnan po natin ito. Yon ay H1N1. Ito rin. Isang flu. Yun. Ang virus ito, 2009, naroon ay March ay umpisa ng Mexico. April ay US. Naroon ay June ay 50 state ay US ito. June 11 ay Pandemic na. World Health Office. Naroon declared. Okay. H1NI. This is also pandemic. Worldwide yan sa akin. Ayun sa kasaysayan. Tingnan po natin. Noong dati H1NI, marami na matay mga patay. Ito ages uh, 10 to 19. Ito mga teenager na marami na matay. Ngunit, na yun. Coronavirus iba. Coronavirus ay 70 plus, 80 plus. Sila ay namatay. Tingnan po natin, teenager 0.022. Ang inyo, ang coronavirus ay bihira namatay mga batay. Kaya huwag kayong matagot. Okay? Kasi ito po, coronavirus naman, maraming complicated sa kinyo. Nalo na matanda. Tingnan po natin, nakita natin, 50 years old. Sa taas, 59, at sa 60, 70, 80. Unti-unti mas marami. Unti-unti mas marami. Okay, tingnan po natin. Ibig sabihin, mga lola, lolo ay delikado. Kaya nga sa Pilipinas rin, hanggang 60, na yun 65 yata. Bawal yun. Sa labas, bakit? Lola, lolo ay sino mang may ay positive na medyo walang damo niya. Dahil mahina lungs, mahina ang puso, may asma na, yun ay delikado ito, coronavirus. Kaya nga, ingatan tayo, mga lola-lolo. Patuloy tayo, pray natin para sa lola-lolo. Kaya sa oras nito, bilang king's kid, anong gagawin natin? Una sa lahat, kailangan manalangin tayo. Patuloy manalangin. Panginoon, tulungan nyo kami. Panginoon, tulungan nyo. Kabayan po sa pansa ito. Panginoon, patuloy na alisin lahat ng mga di magandang virus na ito. So, yo, let us continue pray. Pray continually. Everybody say, pray continually. Pray continually. Okay. Pray okay. continually. Tagalog person ay maging matiyaga sa panalang. It is it. Let us continue pray. Why? You know, Jesus say, come unto me, or who you are worried and a burden, and I will give you less. Jesus always invite us. I think ito, Tagalog po siyang sabi dito, lumapi kayo sa akin, kayong lahat na nahihirapan at lupang nagbibigatan sa inyong pasanin at kayo'y bibigyan ko ng kapahinga. Jesus already invite us. Kaya let us continue, lumapi tayo sa Panginoon Diyos. Dahil sinabi ni Jesus Christo, you did not choose me, but I chose you and appoint you So that you might go and build proof, proof that will last. And so that whatever you ask in my name, the Father will give you. 
Sinabi ni Jesus Kristo mismo. Tingnan po natin sa tulo dito. Okay, may under na. Ang anumang hihini nyo sa ama sa aking pangalan ay ibibigay sa inyo. Sinabi ni Jesus Kristo. Kaya nga, when you pray to God, pinakatulo, ano? In the name of Jesus. Everybody say, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Okay. Hindi na tayo pumili ay Jesus. Kundi siya mismo. Sinabi ni Jesus Christ na ako ang pumili sa inyo. Hinirang ko kayo upang kayo humayo at magbunga at manatili ang inyong, inyong bunga. Sa kanyon, pagkatapos sabi ni Jesus. Okay. Ano mang hihini nyo sa ama? So, sa ating Pamilya may sakit, tatay inay may sakit, lola lola may sakit. Anong kakangin natin? Pray. Pray. Never give up. Pray tayo. Pangalawa, tingnan po natin. Ang family is the best gift of God. Baki, ngayon, mas maraming oras nasa inyong family. Hindi ka isa, ano, nung dati naman, maraming oras nasa school tayo. Pero ngayon, kayo yung lagi kasama pamilya. Kaya tandaan po natin, pamilya is the best gift of God. Bakit? Ito po, pamilya mula sa ating Panginoon Diyos. Kaya nga, ating Panginoon Diyos mismo gumawa ng pamilya ito. Father and mother, I love you. Yon ay pamilya. Kaya nga, bilang anak, anong gagawin natin? This is Ephesians chapter 6, verse 1 and at saka 3. Sabay-sabay tayo. Bakit buksan nyo ang iyong microphone. Sabay-sabay din, pasahin po natin. Wow! Okay, bukas na. Ma, ang yung microphone open. One, two, go. Children. Obey your parents in the law. So this is a life. That is a may. Only the yo. And then you may enjoy long life on the earth. Sino sabi, ang yang, ang yang, ang yang, ang yang. Okay. Okay. Tingnan po natin. Ito po, Bible niya. Sabi yung Bible niya, Children, obey your parents in the Lord. Okay. For this is your life. Okay. Bulaga pa. Bulaga. Sino bulaga? Bulaga. Tingnan po natin. Kaninong baby ito? Ariel baby ba? Okay. Tingnan po natin. Tayo ay kasama parents, kasama tayo pamilya, kaya nga bilang anak. Okay? Tayo ay kailangan sundin natin ating magulang. Baki, ito po ay karapatapa sa harapan ng Panginoon. At saka ang ating buhay, sabi dito, you... You may go where with you. Okay. You may enjoy long life on the earth. Maging mahaba buhay, sabi ng people. Kaya nga, we cannot see Almighty God. But we can see our parents. Parents are representative of God. Okay? Kaya nga, kailangan bilang anak, kailangan sundin natin ating magulay. Yun ay gusto ng Panginoon. Kaya nga, tingnan po natin. Okay? Okay? Sa, sa Esmond Tutu sabi niya, you do not choose your family. They are God's gift to you as you are to them. Sabi niya ito, hindi tayo pumili aking pamilya. Yun. Ang pamilya ito, ating Panginoon, mula sa ating Panginoon Diyos. Ito pala, digalo mula sa Panginoon Diyos. Kaya nga, kailangan sundin natin. Ati magulang. Tingnan po natin. Noong panahon, si Josue, sabi niya, mga Israel ta ayaw makinig salita ng Diyos. Kaya nga sabi niya, yung Josue sabi dito, If you serve the law seems understandable to you, then choose yourself this day whom you are served. Kasi mga Israel ta ayaw makinig. Amorea, Mesopotamia, ang daladalang mga Diyos-Diyosa niya. Kaya nga sabi ni Josue, galing na galing. Sige, pili kayo. Pero sabi dito, as for me and my household, 
We will serve the Lord. Sabi ni Josue. Tingnan po natin, sabay-sabay tayo. Pasahin po ng Tagalog portion. One, two, go. At kung At ayaw kung ninyo, maglilin ko, kayawin. Bili kayo ngayon. Sino ang inyong paglilingkuran? Ang mga Diyos na paglilingkuran na ang inyong mga ninuno sa amin sa Kutamia. Ang mga Diyos na mga amoy. Na sinasamba dito sa lupay inyo. Ngunit para sa amin sa aming pamilya, kayawin ka kami ng Amen! Okay, Amen. Amen. Ngunit para sa akin at sa aking sambayan, ano daw? Kayawin lamang kami maglilingkod. Kaya nga, sa oras na ito, patuloy tayo. Our pamilya ay patuloy lingkod sa ating Panginoon Diyos. Yun ay gusto ang Panginoon Diyos. Ay nga sabi dito, isang prayer, pray for family unity. Okay? Let us patuloy pray natin. We we'll lift up your family. Okay? Our family before your old God. Give them peace in their hectic lives as well as protection against all evil wherever they go. Allow each individual to go to be a blessing to others. I Declare that all confusion, hatred, envy, pride against one another will be dispelled in Jesus' name. Everybody say, Amen. 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 Okay. Amen. Our family, I. Okay. Amen. Our, pa- Amen. Our family, I. Malakas na. Kayo rin bless yo. Ang ating family ay mahira, mahira nyo sa society sa pumun. Kaya let us. Prayer, okay? God, with us. Patuloy tayo. Proclaim. Okay, the last one, sabi dito, ang ating isipan naman, we are nasan? Citizens of heaven. Why? The Bible says this, sabi dito. Philippians chapter 3, verse 20, sabi dito, we are citizens of heaven where the Lord Jesus Christ lives. Sabi dito, and we are Eagerly waiting for him to return as our savior. Sabi ng Apostle Paul sa Philippos Church, ang kanyang sulat ito, ang ating citizenship ay hindi sa lupa. Sabi ng Apostle Paul ay Colossian Church. Okay, narito English eh. Sa kabilang dako tayo ay mga mamayan ng langin, sabi ito. Mula noon, hinihintay natin may pananabik ang Panginoon Jesus sa ang ating tagapalitasa. Pagkatapos sabi niya, Colossians chapter 3, verse 2, sabi dito, Send your minds on things above, not on earthly things. Kaya kahit pandemic ito, mahira, pero sa ating isipan naman, hindi sa lupa yun. Nasa langin. This is King's King. King's King naman, konti lang may lumo-lumo, ay sabi niya, ay baka putog tao, polka ng taal uli o maraming mga sabi kanong pandemi na mga tao ay maging mahina ya. kaya nga konti lang may luma na unga kanon ba takot-takotin pero sa ating kingski naman sabay-sabay tayo pasan po natin one, two, go ang mga bagay na panlamit ang isin ninyo hindi mga bagay na ang lupa ibang krasa ng tao ya. King's kid ay ibang krasen tayo. We are different. Not like this elderly people. Tayo ang ating isipan. Our mind ay nasa? Nasa langin. Above. Nasa langin. Kaya sa oras na ito, kung tayo ay kuritsan, ako'y ang aking realize na may citizenship in the heaven na naroon ay umpisa na tayo anong responsibility sa Mundong ito. Ito yun. Kasi marami tao hindi niya alam kung sino ako. Hindi niya alam kung sino siya. Kaya nga magulong mundong ito. Kaya nga buhay ng Christian. Okay? Mga kings kinama. Alam ko na. Ang aking tunay na bayan ay nasa langin na. May, may real citizenship in heaven. So alam ko na anong tapak kagawi sa mundong ito. Magulong mundong ito. Zirang mundong ito ay tayo ay maging daluyan ng pagpapale. Kaya sa oras na ito, okay, kilala niyo sino? Ito? 
si Yes, Abraham Lincoln. Sino kaya? Yes, Abraham Lincoln ay 16 President of the United States. Siya ay, siya ay manguna American Civil War, North and South. Siya ay manguna na. And then the country greatest moral, constitutional, and the political crisis. Siya mismo lahat ayos na. This Pangulo ay hanggang ngayon very well known na sa Amerika Pangulo. Siya ay nalo na succeed. Ano yun? Preserving the union, abolishing the slavery. Slavery. Noong dati ay mga alipin niya sa Amerika. Mga negro ay alipin. Pero sa pamagin na Abraham Lincoln ay lahat dissolve. Abolishing. Tapos na ito. Kaya nga, Barack Obama ang kanyang kalingsa doon sa Afrika, Kenya. African ay maging pangulo pa rin. Kung wala na, Abraham Lincoln hindi pwede. Kaya nga, Abraham Lincoln ay siya ay hindi na mag-aral sa King's Gate. Hindi siya pumasok sa elementary school. Siya ay napakahiram ng buwan. Pero mula sa ang kanyang inay, anak, anak, ang aking mana ay isang Bible lang. Biblia lang. Ana, ito po. Ito yung ang aking mana. Sabi niya, inay ay Bible lang bigay sa kanya. Kaya nga Abraham Lincoln hawang ng Bible lang. Maging Pangulo. White House ay maging prayer house. Si Abraham Lincoln. Kaya nga sa oras na ito, tingnan po natin, ang kanyang buhay, napakagrabe. Ang kanawa lang trabaho, ang kanyang tipiteda, at saka pale na business, at saka ang kanyang girlfriend rin na matay. Lahat puro tipiteda, at saka gusto niyang kongres na ano, black teda, at saka lost ang kanyang re-nomination, at saka re-rejected, rejected, declined, oh. tipiteda. Pero, 1860, naroon, finally, elected president na Amerika yan. Tingnan po niya, ang kanyang buhay puro fail, 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 fail. Ang kanyang sentro naman. Paki? Sa Panginoon. Kaya maging Pangulo. Amerika yun. Ang kanyang hitsura marami ang balbas. Kaya nga, ah, ang kanyang kaibigan, ah, ang kanyang par, kaibigan naman sabi, ang kanyang prenda magpiro yun. Oy, gorilla, gorilla, gano'n. Pero si Abraham naman, maluang ng puso yun. Siya mismo maging cabinet member. Yun ang Pangulo, Abraham Lincoln. Ang kanyang salita, okay, sabay-sabay tayo. One, two, go. Never, ano? Never give up. Never give up. Never give up. Kaya nga, katulad Abraham Lincoln, tayo ikay pandemic pa, never give up. Ngayon, orasa na ito, tatulong bagay sinabi ko. Ano? We have to continue pray. Pray continually. Okay? Pangalo, ano? Tandaan po natin, tayo'y maging masunurin sa pata. Okay? Sa inyong sambaya, family is the best gift of God. Kaya tayo'y maging masunurin tayo, tayo'y maging mabay ng pata, at saka kalugulo sa ating Panginoon. So the last, ano? Our citizenship is nasa? Nasa heaven tayo. Kaya nga ating isipan ay hindi panglupa, kundi tanglangit. Tanglangit. Okay? Okay? Sa pamay ating buhay, God will continue bless. Amen po ba tayo? Okay. Natay yumuko, manalangin po tayo. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, thank you so much, Father God. This is a wonderful day. Even though we are midst of a pandemic, Lord, continue bless your children, Panginoon. Pagpalain po sila ang kanyang buhay, ipagtuloy ilo malapis sa inyo po, Panginoon. Ah, Panginoon, salama po our family, Panginoon. Pagpalain nyo po, buong sambayan po, Panginoon. Pagpalain ba aming buhay ay hindi sa pang lupa lang, kundi aming isipan ay nasa langit po, Panginoon. Kaya aming isip, ang puso ay maluwang na, maluwang na po, Panginoon. Kaya pagpalain niyo po ang iyong mga anak po, Panginoon. Patuloy na kamitin mo po sila para sa inyong kaluwal hatian. Maraming maraming salamat po. Ito po sa mutalangin na matamis na pangalan ng Panginoon Jesus. Lahat na mga anak ng Diyos sabi natin, Amen! 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 Amen. God bless you! Amen! Amen. Thank you po, Pastor Lee. Kings Kids, are you blessed? Yes. yes. Okay, so now, for the meantime, keep your 
Offering in a jar. And for the closing prayer and benediction, let us welcome again our Pastor Lee. Okay, let us pray all together. Manala in Tayasa, Ayinan Diasa. Let's pray. Panginoon, maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong takilang biyaya na way pagpala niyo po ang inyong mga anak po narito. Lord, kahit kami ay pandemic pa, ngunit Panginoon, patuloy na pagpala niyo po ang inyong mga anak kahit saan na ron, kahit anong kakawin. Pagpala niyo po ang kanyang sampayan po, Panginoon. Tanggapin mo po opering na ito para sa inyong gawain. Lord, paling po sa kanila, siksik lilig at umapo po, Panginoon. May the grace of Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and fellowship of Holy Spirit be with you now and forever more. Lahat na maanak ng Diyos sabi natin, Amen! 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 God bless you. Amen! Now let us welcome our HR manager, Sir Elius, for some announcement. Okay, so good morning, King's Kids. Good morning, Good morning. Good morning. So Good morning, praise God. Sir praise God for the success of our chapel R uh, this week. So here are some announcements. So our quarter third quarter assessment will be on February 23 and 24, 2021. Hindi in 2020, 2021 po. And then please update your tuition and other school fees for assessment permit. So please remind both your parents that they need to report uh, here in the school office for them to up the, uh, update the tuition and this other school fees. So in this third quarter assessment, we will implement the no uh, assessment permit, no test, no assessment. Ano ha? So please pakiremind. And then after the um, after the uh, assessment, we will be having a foundation week. It will be on uh, March 1 to 5, 2021. So that is our foundation week. And then we have lots of activities. We have academic day. In the academic day, we have academic competition, Bible quiz, and drawing and poster. So we also have the cultural or cultural day. Next, uh, this is cultural day. We have a what we call the tip pitch. So I know that everybody... Uh, really likes TikTok, but this time we are going to make it tick pitch, um, a motivational and um, a very educational TikTok. Then we also have the parent-child talent tandem. So I believe that you have lots of talents together with your parents. So why not of having a video of your talents and send to your advisor so that it will serve as an entry for this competition. Kung maruno kayong sumayaw, kumanta, or cooking, or planting, whatever talents that you have, most especially in this pandemic, all the talents that you have discovered uh, in this pandemic, why not of making a video of it and then make it an entry. Then we will be having also a creative memory verse reciting. Um, we are going to be give you a um, uh, Bible verse, then you're going to memorize, and then you are going to make it creative with action or whatever props that you are going to use and make a video of it and then you are going to make it an entry. And then we also have the spoken poetry for our high school. We will be having a competition for those who like um, uh, the poetry. Okay, so these are some of the possible activities 
that we will observe for our week-long activities in line with the celebration of our foundation week. So uh, we solicit your cooperation in this activities. No, kung maaari ay lahat ay kasante. We also have here the Mr. and Miss King's Kids 2021. Hindi na insulat ni teacher. Okay, so we also have the the competitions. Kaya nga kung your teacher or your advisor ask you to join in that particular contest, why not of grabbing your opportunity? We will be giving you incentives in joining these activities. Okay, so that's all. Okay, so that's all. Thank you so much for and I we are God bless. God bless you all. God bless you all. And uh, good morning again. You may now proceed to your, uh, proceed to your uh, small group with your teacher, with your advisor for more instruction. Okay. God bless you. Bye-bye. God bless you. Have a nice day. God bless you. Okay. Have a nice day. Bye.